Hello and welcome to another beautiful episode of Gatsby WordPress theme development. In the previous video we learned about how to create the footer and how to create the stories for the footer as well and in this video we're going to do the search and this is something that a lot of you have been asking me as well. So what we're going to do is there are different ways of uh, doing this implementing the search functionality. You can do live query, uh, you know you can also do static query as well uh, so we've been going to build the static search because th this is a PWA application so we want this to work offline alright so there is a package called JS search I've already explained that uh, to you in my previous episodes if you have been following along uh, you know or even if you're not you can go over here you can find those uh, you can you can follow along th this series okay so we have already installed a JS search just to show you it's gonna give you like a quick recap of how this is going to be done so there's something called js search js search so this is the package you need to install i've already explained that and then in your create page template which is this uh, i have my front page and inside of this i'm actually going to get all of the posts so you can see that i'm getting all of the posts the categories etc and then over here I'm also looping through all of the posts and ensuring that the categories are also pushed inside of the all of the all the posts and then uh, as a part of the uh, as a part of the JS search package when you go on to the JS search package it will tell you that these this is the data that it looks for which is post search data all posts options and whatever you want uh, the title index author and category so I want my search to work whether the user searches by title by author name or even by category so whatever you search over here whatever categories like group etc so you can see that I'm still getting the post that belongs to that category okay so this is going to uh, give the data and the template that I'm using for that is basically the front page and then this is where we're going to create the search component so you can download the git repository uh, which is Gatsby WordPress themes uh, once you download that then you will have the inside of the home you have the client search and the search result and the search so these are the three ones that you're going to need so I'm just going to paste that and then explain to you what what goes on there okay I'm going to cl close all of this and just go to my components and then just paste those components alright so let me explain that to you how that works so again if you go on to packages Gatsby WordPress themes then you go to your source then you go to templates and you go to front page you will notice that the component that we are using for the search section is basically this one right here which is search so I'm gonna go to my page template which is index.js and I'm just going to paste this search data and now I also need to import it so just import search component search okay and I'm going to pass the search section data over here uh, all the post and inside of the engine I'm going to pass all of these options okay so if okay just to let you know that in the in the previous video uh, we have not included the footer in the layout so we need to include that as well so just go over here components layouts and just copy the this entire layout section and just replace this with that so you can see that we are actually importing the prop types uh, we've got the styles the header the footer and then you've got the main inside of which we have got the children and stuff right uh, inside of this search section you're pulling off the background image the search label taxonomy taxonomy one icon one icon two all of that stuff and then uh, ba basically these are all of this stuff that we have available uh, inside of this and if you go on to the home page so so we're using the ACF fields basically and uh, using the ACF fields we've got our custom home page set up and this is our search section so these taxonomies are coming from here 
a search label is coming from here uh, background image is coming from here and then we also have these three icons so all of that data and then we are passing all of this engine and all the posts etc okay if you go on to the JS search Gatsby this is the documentation of that so you can find information about how these components are built so they've given all of the information here I'm just used taking the reference of the same okay so you've got the client search component then inside of the client search component and passing all of the data is checking if it's loading search result indexed by categories all of that stuff these are all the functions everything has been described over here you can check it out and then we are rebuilding index and then we are checking all of this information and finally inside of the render we have the query results we have the form the label enter your search here the input element and this component basically is going to give me the search result okay so that's what's happening over here and coming back so again this section is basically to get all of the categories so these categories that you see so that's coming from there okay and then we just uh, export default search all right just fix this part it's not showing properly and also ensure that this client search and search result and search all of these are actually inside of home because the part of the home and all right so let's do that I think that should rebuild and uh, just make sure that uh, since we changed that let's make sure the home has it uh, let's refresh it awesome so you've got our search component as well amazing uh, say hello you can see that it takes us to the 404 page because we haven't really created these pages but our search functionalities does work if I search adventure over here adventure you can see that all of the posts related to adventure are being displayed congratulations for creating the search functionality and I'm gonna see you in the next video where we will do the featured post section okay uh, so I hope you did like the video if you did please give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you aren't already and I'm gonna see you in the next video thank you very much